Hi, this is one lesson I used to teach geography to my kindergarten students. What I did was I took six sheets of paper, one, two, three, four, five, six, and they're just circles um, and they get smaller and smaller or larger and larger, whichever way you want to read it. Um, the first one is my house and what I'm doing is I label each circle. So I have my house, my city, my state, my country, my continent, and my planet. And so then what I do is I just have one of these and I do a whole group lesson and I talk about how this is my house and see this is really small but when I look at my city it's a little bit bigger and you can draw maybe an outline of what your city looks like and then I'll flip it up and as it gets bigger well, my state is bigger than my city and my country is bigger than my state. Um, we talk about how my continent is bigger than the country I live in and then last how the planet is bigger than the continent. So um, what we, why I do this is because I want them to I want to give them a visual about um, the size of the place that they live in a way that they can compare. So you can ask questions like uh, which one is bigger is it would it be where you live? or the continent you live on and then they can talk about no i live my house is smaller than the continent and this also gives you um, a place where you can uh, label and write down what continent you live on um, where your house is in your neighborhood um, on in your city you can you know extend this and talk about mapping and directions and then also in your state where in your state um, do you live? Do you live in the north, south, east, or west part of your state? Um, so it's a really good reference. Also, um, you can have kids build their own, and then they can use it to have conversations with each other about their um, home, city, state, country, continent, planet. And that's one way that I teach um, geography to my kindergartners. Thanks.